he's carrying quite a few knocks, but there's no chance he's going to uh, say to me before the game that he doesn't want to play. Well, it, there's been a lot of talk of creativity on the midfield. Uh, Juan Mata uh, showed a bit of that today, didn't he? Uh, how impressive was he? He was an excellent, Juan. He's, uh, he, uh, when we get Juan facing forward, he can pick passes, he can put crosses in. Uh, delighted with him. He's, he's a vital member of the squad and uh, today I thought we uh, we found him uh, more than we've done before when he's played and we could get him facing forward and create chances for us. Was that right side uh, tweak uh, a successful one? Was that, uh, did that help? Yeah, I think Juan played really well and the way well, Mason's played there a few times, that's a different uh, left-sided or left-footed one so today we felt this was the right uh, team to go with. Well, just before you put the cross in for the first goal, you were having a bit of a conversation with him. Yeah. Can I just help what I was about? No. <laughs> well, I should not ask how he, how he was feeling and how his family is. No, <laughs> no it's, uh, there was just, just a couple of little things that we've, uh, we've spoke about before. Right. Ollie, you wanted uh, no feeling sorry for himself. You wanted a reaction. Was clearly, you feel that you've got one. Yeah, excellent. You know, I'm very, very happy when the opposition manager can talk and think about how hard Man United are working and the atti when the attitude is right. It was That was the, the key today, intensity, win the ball back after you've lost it, no disappointed heads, you, can't, you don't have time to do that. And today I felt the attitude was right. Because if you let Norwich play, which they want to do, they want to play, they've got quality players, then it'll be a, a tough game at Old Trafford because then uh, you'll be running in between and the crowd might be edgy. And But today we, we got an excellent response. Every time we lost the ball, you see Anthony, Juan, Andy, uh, Marcus, they're all chasing after the ball. Is it safe to say that Brian Williams is first choice left back now, given how well he's playing? We want to get to a place where players understand that if I play well, I'll... I'll uh, keep my place and if I don't, there's a competition behind us and we've got good competition there now. And Brandon's, as we've said, he's never ever let us down. And uh, another excellent performance by him. Do you think, he's, do you think his hunger <coughs> and his determination, desire to get up and down that pitch is actually a lesson to some of your senior players? Definitely a lesson for everyone who wants to be a professional footballer, the attitude that he's showing. And it'll be up to him and me and the club to keep him that hungry. Cause, uh, uh, but I don't expect him to change because uh, he, he does have the right. He, he's got the heart for it. And when you have it, you have it. Oli, um, <coughs> Marcus is 200th uh, United game today. No, no finer way to celebrate that than, than with his goals, and particularly the first one, which was a good finish. But what an achievement he, uh, to get to 200 games at his age. Uh, I don't know how many goals he scored now totally. Uh, and to 19 this season. He's been, he's been absolutely uh, top class to work with. Great kid, great attitude, wants to learn, wants to improve, knows to keep his feet on the ground, is always available. Uh, even though today, you know, he's, he's carrying quite a few knocks but there's no chance he's going to uh, say to me before the game that he doesn't want to play. Will he be uh, OK for Tuesday? <clears throat> I don't know. He might not be. Uh, but uh, if he's ready, he's, uh, and if I decide to play him, uh, you'll see. But uh, this, uh, He's played many, many games, so I might uh, have to look at it, how we can manage him. Uh, but we, we've got a week off very soon after in Feb. Do you think he can get better? Uh, he's only very young. Of course he can. He, he, he will become so much better. Uh, but, but he's got every little, every little, no, little, not little, he's got everything to be a top, top class player. Uh, attitude, skill, physique, uh, just trying to, you know them goals he scores today from inside the, to the six yard box, more of them, then he'll be, uh, he'll be uh, exceptional. And Amazing, well. Amazing, yeah, but you you expect him to <laughs> you expect him to hit the target. It's, it's great goal. Delighted that I've got three centre forwards scoring today. Uh, can I just ask why Ashley Young wasn't in the eighteen? <clears> is that connected with his Inter Milan contract situation? He wasn't fit to play. Can you say something more about what you have 
spoken with Matt about and what you <laughs> no, 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 it's just tactical things and we, we, we speak throughout the week and we what we want him to do. You know, some you let Juan find the solutions. I can't find the solutions for him uh, from, from the sideline. It's But we want to get him on the ball as much as we can and it was important that he, he kept finding spaces. Do you think he might play a little bit more in the league from the start? Juan, yeah, it's, you know, he's, he's a very good footballer and we need to find find him in his feet you know we got we need to know what we're good at and yeah we got quick players we could, I could have chosen Dan uh, but f with his pace but Juan gives us a, a different dimension Oli, Oli I have to ask you this um, there were some chance uh, anti Glazer chance and, and anti chance about Ed Woodward does that kind of thing um, filter through to you or do, do, in the players or do you just block that out I'm not sure if the players will think of uh, get it but I, I noticed, yeah, and you know, we've as a club, we've got to stick together. We've got to be united. Uh, we are a family. I, I can only say from when I've been here, I've been backed by uh, the owners, backed by uh, Ed, and they're supporting me. And so for me, uh, make sure we stick together. That's, we are we are in all competitions. We are um, still in Carabao Cup, FA Cup. We're fifth in the league. We're still challenging. We've improved uh, position from from last season. We got Europa League, uh, so they've just got to believe me when I say I feel we're doing loads of good things behind the scenes. We are going in the right direction. See the group today. That attitude and effort and work rate—that's the core of the group that's going to go forward. Okay, guys. Thank you.